How would you like to present your pie chart with animation that is able to expand a segment of the pie chart and at the same time contract another segment, just like this? Welcome to another episode of Amazing Sticky Presentation inspired by Sticky Spy, bringing you tips, ideas, design for better presentation, turning your ideas into lasting impressions. Hey, Tian Tech here from Sticky Spy. Too many charts we see in presentation slides that are too common and boring. In my previous video, I talked about using animation to exchange a pie segment. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can visually expand a segment of a pie chart from 15% to 20% in PowerPoint using simple animation. If you are a Keynote user, I will be making a similar video showing you how to do this in Keynote. So subscribe to my channel to get notified. Click on the subscribe button now before you forget. Let's start. Make a duplicate of the slide containing the static pie chart that you have created from my previous video and prepare the Japanese and Korean segment so that we can use the spin animation effect. If you are not sure how to do this, watch my previous video. The links to the videos are in the description below. Next, make a duplicate of the Korean segment. Then adjust the arc of the Korean segment shorter to about half of its original length. Now, duplicate the Japanese segment. Move the duplicate segment aside so that we can access the original segment below it. Adjust the arc length of the original segment to about two-thirds of its original length. Next, reposition the duplicate Japanese segment to sit exactly on top of the original segment and adjust the arc length to about half. Now, we need to reorder the layers so that both the duplicate segments are directly above its original segment and the value labels on the respective pie segments are fully visible. As the pie segment expand and contract, its values too need to be adjusted. We will now make duplicate labels to reflect new values of each segment which are 20% for Korean and 30% for Japanese. Great, let's animate now. Select both the Japanese and Korean pie segment, then add the spin animation effect from the emphasis section. Spin clockwise, 18 degrees. When both segments are animated together, by default, PowerPoint will assign start on click for the first segment and start with previous for the rest of the selection. Let's play the animation now to see how it looks. Yeah, it looks good. Now we need to hide the original labels and then show the duplicate labels after the animation of the pie segments have completed. Select both the original labels and assign fade effect from exit effects. Assign start with previous, duration 0.5 of a second, delay 0.3 seconds. Next, select both the duplicate labels that has the new values and assign appear effect from entrance effects and start after previous. As the pie segment expand and contract, we want the data labels of the respective segment to slowly fade off before we show the new values. Therefore, we assign a 0.3 of a second delay to the data labels before it starts to fade off. Let's see how it looks on slideshow mode. Wow, it looks fantastic. This idea will add an interesting touch to your overall presentation. The next time you need to show an increase of a pie segment, for example, increase in market share against your competitor, as compared to previous year. You can use this method. It will make your presentation super slick. 
If there are interesting ideas that you want to add to your presentations and would like to see a video on how it can be implemented, let me know in the comments below. I hope you had fun animating your pie chart with this video. Before you go, do give this video a like and subscribe to this channel for more presentation tips and ideas. Until my next video, continue to design amazing presentations. Bye-bye.